this award. Quit. I set out on a narrow way many years ago, hoping I would find true love along the broken road. We're off. Hi again. Hi. Probably gonna notice in some videos that we have the same clothes on. As we did in the last video. And maybe the next video. We but know. we may be in different clothes for the, in shortly here because this may go later. <laughs> we're, we're, we're like, we have like five videos to make. And we yeah. need to make them outside down in our garage because the stuff we got is outside down in our garage. And some of it's not coming up here. So we don't want to cart it up here and have to cart it back down again. Yeah. But unfortunately... It's still raining! Yay! Because you'll notice we said, oh, it's starting to rain in the last video, and well, now this is where we're at. Yeah, happy Memorial Day. Today's Sunday? Sunday. Yeah. Tomorrow's Memorial Day. Yeah. I hope nobody here, they've got a big festival in the park going on here. Yeah, right now. Uh, well, it's a, little, a damp festival. Yeah, in downtown on that big, huge, yeah. once a year thing. And there was, they showed it in the news last time, so it's like all weekend. There were yeah. people out there with little umbrellas going around. Uh, like, yeah. No. No, they ain't got nothing I want to see that bad. Uh, oh, so this is going to be part of an auction, an online auction that I got. Uh, the rest of it's down in the garage, so it'll probably be, well, it will be two parts. Yeah. Uh, this was Grumpy Tommy. Yeah. Uh, Can you tell us about our experience there? <laughs> You want to talk about it? Yeah, you can talk about it. I just sat. It was hot. She just sat in the van. I sat in the van in the air conditioning. Yeah. He went and did the stuff. No, we pull up and it's this out in the countryside and there's this rich, rich people, here. rich people. And there's this go right went right past it the very first time. I didn't even see the uh, sign because it sat back on the driveway a little bit and there's woods all around it. And so we turned around and came back and there's this driveway and we parked off just next to it and I walk up to the people and I says. Well, we got about 20 people standing in line down there, but you can pull your van in and park it along the side of the driveway, and we'll let you know when there's room to get your van down there. So we pull over and sit there in a nice shady spot and had the air conditioner running. We sit in the for, I don't know, 45 minutes. Tommy has this, we don't know, he has um, a rule. I may have said this before. You have to come up, you pay him, and then he has helpers, like three or four people. Yeah. And they have your list that they have. And they go and gather, like, first floor, basement, garage, shed. They go gather the stuff, and they put it on a table, and you check on you know, your list as they're bringing the stuff out to make sure you've got everything. And then you sign that you've received it, and then you take it, and you go. Yeah. Then number two comes up. The next person. So you can imagine. It could be a little slow getting things out. Yeah, and do not, do not, not complain. Complain or, or tell him there's a better way to do it. Yeah. No. He, you he will be on like his that. poopy list. Yeah. And you don't want to. I know a friend who got on his poopy list and complained, and um, she hasn't won anything since. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. So we sat anyway, there about so 40, 40, 45 I minutes, you know. In a van. I uh, we were sitting there enjoying ourselves, listening to in. music and uh, having a good time. And also we said, well, it's been a while. Let me go check on it. So I walk out back to the guy at the guard, the gate guardian there. And I start talking with him for a little bit. And he says, well, you know, we still have all these people down there. And I says, well, you know, as soon as something happens, you know, all of a sudden while we're talking, a car with a trailer and then a Jeep with a trailer come out and they go away. And he turns to me and says, go. <laughs> And I said, okay, I hop in and I head on down there. Well, that's step one. And then we get down there and I find a place to park and I get situated. And she stays in the van. I let it run and stay air conditioning. And I go out and get in the little, oh, I was what? There was about 10 or 12 people in line at that time. Well, you got you, over there in the shade, but then yeah. there was eight more. Uh, eight at more table. at the table, yeah. So you got 20 people in yeah, line. Yeah, we got 20 people. So I get at the end of the line and we're slowly just working our way down, working our And finally, get up to the table after, uh, I, I don't know, it's been, it's been a while. I lost track of time. Uh, we got there at about oh, 12, 30, 1 o'clock. We got there about 1 o'clock, right? Yeah, probably. Around yeah. 1 o'clock. It was about 3.30 when I finally got up to the table. I'm pretty sure it was right about then. And 
And then it was like, okay, here you go, money. And they started oh, yeah, gathering and he, stuff. He and, knows me. Yeah. So the first thing he said to him when he handed the paper oh, yeah. was, he says, Debbie? <laughs> and I says, oh, she's over in the van. I ain't stupid. My mama didn't raise no clue. I'm sitting over in the air conditioned van. Yeah. My allergies have been giving me fits. It was, so. it was one of those, you don't look like Debbie. <laughs> yeah, he knows me. He likes me. Yeah. Uh, he yeah. actually gave us a, a little discount. A disc- he always gives me yeah. a little discount. But anyway, yeah. uh, I brought all the jewelry that I won, and I have no idea. No idea. I was just, they had some fabulous stuff. It was, I mean, fabulous. I wish oh, I had had. Oh, gracious. If yeah. we had the money to bid on some of this stuff. But I actually bid like $350, and we only won 119 yeah. worth. I don't know what these people, they had some Corningware, they had a TRS-80 Radio Shack old computer, they had yeah. some gorgeous... Any, any of you know old computers, a Radio Shack TRS-80 Model 4, people love them things. Yeah, they had Malik Crystal, I mean, they had some really, but I mean, I put some, what I consider, I normally try to get six times my money back, uh, if it's more... Like, say, if I pay 20 and I'll get 60, I'll, I'll do two times, you know, triple my money. These things were so expensive that I would have been happy to just double my money. So I, I bid some pretty good amounts. I don't know what these people did, but they were yeah. bidding. I couldn't do it. I couldn't yeah. do it. If I'd wanted it for me, that would have been one thing. But you have to resell? No. So, we have, oh, Ooh. funny, I pulled this out. Buttons. Five fourteen. 14 I paid $6. You have seen this before. I she likes a, I, Yeah, I have a problem. I have a button problem. Yeah, and right. I love this little bottle. This, this is neat. I swear to you, my father, his whole life. No, you know what that is? That's a spice bottle. Yeah, it is. A spice bottle. That's an old vintage spice bottle. Uh, no, it's got some numbers on it, but, yeah, I kind of got a spot, I really do. and I like this one, too, it's kind of weird. Zest tab. I remember those from Penny's, I used to, I think. Penny's? Was it? No. JC Penny's? No. Pen something. Uh, it's P, it begins with it, I can't remember. But, yeah, the, it's a Zest tab bottle. I have no they, idea what they're from back in the 60s and 70s. Never heard of this time. But anyway, I got me some more buttons because God knows I need some more buttons. Yeah. This is 141 necklace and bracelet vintage style. Vintage style? Yeah. So not necessarily so vintage. $3. No, it is. Yeah, it's, uh... $3 for this one. Caught. There we go. And you know, I mean, I didn't go to the preview, which I don't. I don't know. Um, but uh, it's kind of washing it out. It's yeah. pink and blue, if you can't tell. And I put it on my hand. There, it gets a little more color. Uh. But uh, and then there's more. And a little bracelet. And I don't see any mark at all on it. No, but I thought that was pretty, the pink and blue. Yeah. The one blue looks a little... Boy, oh, yeah, it's tiny. I'm pretty marking the blue. I don't see any. Maybe it was tiny, but yeah, it's pretty. No, no markings anywhere. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's pink, blue, and white. That is, I think it's too big to be a child, but boy, is it dainty. Yeah. Okay. 139. What? I feel like I'm calling bingo. Bingo! <laughs> Bracelet. LaRue, L E R U, vintage. Paid $2 for it. Anyway, this one. There we go. Ooh, shiny. That's the outside. Gold tone. Yeah, that's pretty. Uh, I found this. I looked it up. I tried. If he got a name on it, I tried to look it up. Uh, and I saw this on silver. Uh, somebody had a silver one listed. 
uh, it's sunshine, really? pouring down rain, and the sun is shining so bright right now. Yeah. I used sunshine. to, when I was a kid, I never knew why we said that. Did you ever see that? When it's raining and sunshine at the same time, he said the devil's beating his wife. Yeah, I've heard that, actually. Yeah, you can read it quite clearly, the roof. Yeah, I'll just show you the new thing you got. Okay. Max got a new toy. Got a new toy. Um, now I'll have to pause this for a moment to switch over to this camera. So, you ready? Yep. That was pretty slick. Yeah, Max, I don't know where you saw that at, but he saw that and he had to have one. Yeah. Which is good. Cause we, well, we were watching uh, well, some YouTube people uh, were you talking about it. And, give uh, them credit for it. you got to remember Yeah, i got to remember who it was and give them credit because okay. that is the neatest thing. This, this, is, this is what we love so much about Tommy and we keep putting up with him. Lot 132. See a whole bunch of stuff in there. Pendants and dis and dat. D I S N dat D A T. And he'll do that. He'll just there'll be a box in the lot picture and he'll go dis and dat. A little pair of wooden shoes is part of the dis and dat with some wood burning on the side. I don't know if it says anything. Or is it, it might say something on the side. Cute pair. You can take a look at that. See if that you can make that out. Yeah, it's a souvenir from Holland, I'm sure. Yeah. Either Michigan or the country. <laughs> Yeah. All right. Uh, what was it supposed to be for? A pendant? It said pendants and this and that. Well, there's a chain here. Doesn't feel like it's anything. Yeah, that's a pendant. Oh, yeah, there it is. Oh, I didn't see the little dangly thing there. Yeah, I got it. Button. I can kind of hold it. Yeah, yeah. There's a button. Like with a button thing on the back of it? Yeah, it's a button. Yeah. Yeah. That's kind of I guess I could pull my buttons, huh? Yeah. It's not heavy, it's not old. Well, this is, it's uh, clasp is broken off the back of this. Oh. Can you see that? That looks familiar. Yeah, no, no. I've seen something like that before, but I... oh, another button. That's a different crest. Yeah, that way. Oh, there's a mark on here. Another uh, button. Boy, oh, somebody get a job on there. Oh, I was gonna sit them on here so they won't slip into the fabric. Here. Yeah. Did you want to check out the mark or? No, it looks like somebody really buggered it up. I think they're glass. We were we saw yeah. these and we were debating if they were glass or they're glass. Feels if they like were glass, glass or plastic. And there were a bunch of little elephants. I guess they're hand carved. They're definitely not molded. Hard to tell. It could well. I mean, like the, it was partially molded. I think. You know, it's glass. I think it's heavy. It's and then the legs are stuck on. No, oh, hard to tell. Could be. Yeah. Oh, and then a green one. That's, that's the, the one green. that we looked at the striations yeah. in it, and we, that's why yeah. we thought they were glass. Yeah. No, that's definitely glass. Uh, I don't even know if that, yeah, there was some. These. I mean. There's a, one earring. That's weird. And it is white. Yeah, yeah that's. It's a stone. I mean, it's cold. Yeah, I know. There's stone. I mean, yeah. I think it looks part... like it might have been a bracelet one. Well, yeah, it was a piece from... of jewelry. Yeah. But, yeah. See? There's no, on the other side. side. That side, yeah. yeah. You can see there's a hole through it. So you can see they're stone together. That's pretty. And there's that. No, oh. that's not right. That's not right. No. You got an earring going through it. That's, that's the earring. Mm -hmm. Yeah, not much of an earring. And then there's... What's that? Some sort of pendant. I mean, it doesn't have a pen on it. Oh, it's a pendant. 
Huh. Well, I wanted the uh, elephants. That's what I wanted. Where last mm -hmm. place was one thirty-two. It's kind of busted up and missing stones. Yeah, two bucks. I don't missing worry about stones. That. I can put it in a crap lot. These are little bitty keys or something. Hmm. Whatever you think they are. They look like keys, though. Music box, maybe? Could be a winding key for a music box, yeah. I might keep those in case we find a music box. Another little Yeah, stone. see, I think this is the thing, the green things, too. I think it has those, and then these are the middle level. You know, like, it was oh, one, of these, one of these, one of these, oh, one of these, one of these. Another earring, one by itself, another one, one by itself. Here's a little screw on earring. Got stones in it. Rhinestones. Yeah. Very sad looking earring. <laughs> and guess what? Buttons! Fire button buttons. buttons! Who's got the button? Oh, wait, there's some written on this one. Military's equipment. More military things. Oh, a little bitty earring. Yeah, well, military's equipment. Okay, which brings to mind. I was out driving oh, the other day. That is. And the car in front of me was from Texas. Oh, and a Yellowstone. So we were sitting at a red light or whatever, and I'm just browsing, and I noticed the tag is Texas, and it's a um, disabled tag. So down across the very bottom of the tag, it had this little tiny writing, and I kept trying to read it, and read it, and I finally realized it said, Disabled Veteran of the United States Armed Forces. And I thought about it, and I thought, I'm still thinking about it, and I thought, are we giving disabled veteran tags to the Canadian Armed Forces? To the Mexican Armed Forces? Do we really need to say to the United States Armed Forces on our tags? Max has a, well, he doesn't have a disabled, but he's got I used a, to at one time. I, it's hanging in the garage, my old disabled veteran. But he, he has a veteran's tag, and it yeah. says retired veteran. veteran. Okay. Yeah, that's it. It doesn't say United States odd. or Mexico or Canada or yeah. Guatemala. It doesn't say that. Odd. Isn't that strange? Yeah. Anyway, that was just one of my passing thoughts. I, you know, I thought it was odd. Who knows? Was you got the number? Yeah. One twenty. Four brooches. Got these for one dollar. For a dollar. Over here. All right. Look at that monster. I don't see any markings on it. Mm. I don't see any markings on this one, but for a dollar, just checking. Yeah. That there, there matches one of the earrings that was a lone earring that was in that other bag. I think that is uh, okay. either mother of pearl or abalone. Uh, it kind of looks like Mother of Pearl. Oh, yeah, it could be. It could be I always get those two confused. Well, this one has a mark on it. Look at that. That's pretty. These are heavy. Yeah. This will pull your. You want to use your little handy dandy? See what okay. it is? Let's do that. There, there, there was another little mark. That thing really, really does some magnification on there. Do you want to put these back in a bag or anything? I'm or? putting the ones that are marked right over here. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll do these. Can you just leave these sitting? Yeah. No, I'll just I'll just oh, I really, it. this, you know, this is either going to be a real winner or it's going to be a, uh-uh. I, I really like this. Uh, 153, it's an owl necklace. I paid $5 for it. I thought, even if somebody, oh, what? Would, I see, I'd wear oh, it. Oh, okay, now I understand. I would wear it. 
But you know, they ain't got a girl. But even if yeah, I'm get, I'm you sure. uh, didn't want to wear it, you could use it for like a wall hanging or something. It's, uh, I don't know, it's kind of neat. Yeah. I got to figure out how to get these to lay down. Get a steamer? No, yeah. they're, they're, they're not cloth. They're not but, uh, yeah, I thought it was kind of neat. Now, you know, everybody loves owls. Yeah, nice so, uh, I'd wear it. But then, you know, me, I'm about, I mean, I'm, I'm a dolly and a half, so. But, yeah, hopefully, like I say, it's either going to be a hit or a buzz. Go one on. or the other. Uh, 108. Pearl necklace with matching clip-on earrings. I paid $4. I, I really like. pretty. Yeah. I really mm. like. I mean, I know they're not real That's pearls. Similar. But I like the look of this. Look at that. Isn't that yeah. Pretty? Look at that stone. It's almost like a mirror. I know. I really like that. And then it's got... Oh, those are neat. Yeah. And they match the little hangy dangy dangle thing. Oh, you didn't, show, you didn't even notice that, did you? What? On the hook? Look at the hook. Well, give me a second. Oh, my God. Look at that. Even the it's hook got a has hook. a little stone. It's got a little stone. Turn it there so you can see it. There's a little bitty stone right there. Yeah, four dollars. That's not bad at all. Yeah. Now, the only thing is, it's really it would be a choker on most people. It wouldn't even go around my neck. It'd be a choker, all right. No markings anywhere. No, but that's yeah, that's really it's pretty. Right here. Nothing there. Nothing there. No yeah, markings. that. Yeah, that one. I think I'm gonna try to get that listed. That's really pretty. Oh yeah. I'm going to take all the jewelry separate from the other. 90. Oh, I know. Uh, that's another one I really like. Coro. New with tag vintage necklaces. I paid $3. Two dollars. There's two of them. One was 24 and one was 32 inches. But, uh, yeah, I thought they were neat. New with tag. Coro. Yeah. Does it say how much they originally were? $3. Back in. <laughs> Definitely vintage. Yeah, it says Coro. Um, it's got a code on there, but I, I have no yeah, idea Yeah, before you can see. Yeah. Yeah, but I thought, uh, that, that was $3 really a nice. piece. Yeah. That's pretty. Yeah. I like it. Can you hear the thunder? Yeah. <laughs> and that's 82. Ooh. And that is Ten Tag Big Bill Taylor Brothers Clothing and Worky Mortware, two dollars. That's for Mac. You know he collects. I collect stuff like this. He collects. I'm trying to think what they're called. Tokens. Thank and, you. Uh, the balloons, wood. tokens, uh, wood nickels. Nothing on the back. Anything. He's got a, like a coin album, but it's got yeah, all the all this stuff, all these little weird things in things it. holding it. We didn't. We weren't sure what that was. I knew it was something totally would like. Uh, one thirty magnetic back earrings, four pair for four dollars. This is amazing, probably because of the way my um, you know, crazy and outgoing and gaudy and stuff. I didn't have my ears stretched. I was twenty one years old, and these were real popular back then, and um. <laughs> Magnets jump. Oh, I oh I understand now. You put the yeah magnet behind behind your ear one, and then you put the earring up, and it's supposed to hold it on yeah. your ear. Huh? My mother thought that women with pierced ears were Jezebels, so um, she wouldn't get her ears pierced. I wish I could remember. I don't know, but finally, finally. She'd see, she saw all my earrings, and she was like, oh, gosh, they're so pretty, oh, they're so pretty. And I'm like, well, you need to pierce your ears, you know, because it got harder and harder to find clip earrings. Um, There's the four set. You got one set of magnets and then all these different earrings that go with it. The one magnets, yeah. yeah. Um, so finally, I don't yeah, know. She so had to be in her 60s. I know. Yeah. In her, she finally in her 60s got uh, her ears pierced because uh, all the you know majority of the church ladies had theirs done so she figured okay i'm safe now i'm not going to go to hell for being a jezebel um but yeah and then she just my mother was like my mother would come visit 
and well, God knows she was tiny. She was five feet tall and a hundred and wet pounds. And but it, she would go through my closet and go through my jewelry, and if she liked something, she just took it. Literally, she just took it. Uh, I had this winter coat one time. What's that one? One twelve. Uh, Tacoa three pair pierced. One is gold filled. One dollar. And I, she, she said, I love that coat. I want it. And I said, Mama, the coat, you can wrap around you three times. And she's like, I don't care. I want that coat. I'm like, well, you can have it, but it looks ridiculous on you. And she's like, I don't care. I want it. I said, okay, take the coat. So next time I went up to see her, she's like, you can have this coat back. It's way too big for me. <laughs> I, I know somebody else, somebody had to say to her, you know, Jesse, that coat's huge. What are you doing wearing it? For her to give it back to me because she really liked it. But yeah. My mom, I didn't, oh, you just had to know her. I tell Max all the time, I wish that he had been able to meet her and know her. And I, yeah. 14 characters. She would have loved him to death. This is a gold filled one. $3. Oh, they're all Tacoa. Okay. Yeah, they're all three are Tacoa. Oh, I kind of like those red ones. I don't know. They're not really me, though. I like them. That's over there, not over here. Those are Mark. marked. Oh, I have to hunt for something. Yeah. What is that one? 89. 89. Gold tone necklaces, three and one bracelet. Two dollar. Oh, I remember that. I love cameos. I've probably said it before. And this is really on a cameo. But no, but it's mm, same kind of same category. Model. Yeah, I really like them. And uh, but they just don't suit my personality. This one's marked. Um, but there are people who collect cameos. I know. Yeah, and I actually like this one too. Choker. Yeah. And then there's this little bitty brace or anchor. I don't know what that is. Is that bracelet? Yeah, it's a bracelet. You just got that little kind of like a knot on there. I love knot. Those are called love knots. Oh, okay. They were very popular at one point. I don't know when. I don't know. I guess it's there's a reason they're called love knots. Alright. 154. Oh, that's the one I really like. Looks um, like buttons. One dollar. Imagine you were liking buttons. I can't imagine. That was in here. Yeah, there's a note. Keep this button necklace flat when not wearing it. Don't rumple it in a heap like others. You'll ruin it. You've then been ruined, huh? It's not. It's pretty, isn't it? Very nice. They call yeah. it a yin and yang because of the black and black white. Black and white, yeah. It's very pretty. I, okay. You know, I, I just, I really like it, and you know I love my buttons. But, I just, you know what, I wear such, well, I'm not today, but um, I wear a lot of flower, big flower, gaudy. You kind of get lost. In yeah, and necklaces get lost on me. Uh, that's one reason I like brooches, because I kind of solid brooch. You gotta start wearing them plunging necklines, you know, so it mm. does not have any cloth underneath it, you know, show off that cleavage. Yeah. As soon as I find it. That's pretty that I do like that. Uh, 148 Necklaces four and one bracelet, two dollars. Getting a lot of jewelry this time. He either has none or a bunch. I guess it's the way though. I know women that I don't like jewelry I have any. And I know people like me who have a ton. Pretty. What does the tag say? Says uh, something about purchasing and gift with purchase. Yeah. Uh, so this is a bonus. Then there's 
clothespin? No, honey. It is a clothespin. That's a, that's a clothespin. You go on a laundry line and put it's a clothespin. Who wants to wear a clothespin necklace? No. You didn't believe it. It's not. It's something else. Yeah, it's a clothespin. What, a washerwoman wants to wear clothes in that place? That's interesting. Yeah, no, I thought that one was too. I, don't, I hate that chain, but yeah, a lot of people like it. Kind of I can't work. remember what the name of that chain is. It has a particular name, and a lot of people like it. But, yeah, it almost has kind of like um, an oriental yeah. flair yeah, to it's it for me. Lot. And it's hinged right there. Yeah, if you know the name of that chain, put it with a... Tell me what I know it has a name. I see absolutely no markings on it. I told you to put it up so they can see what it is. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Put the chain up so if they know what the chain is, they can tell me. Thank you. Oh, and then a chain. Yeah, I always keep the chains in case you get a pendant that doesn't have a chain for it. You can... okay. 99, five pair of clip-on earrings, and I got those I for a dollar. Of these, turn it off a little bit. Yeah, those are pretty. These are pearlescent. Here we go. Well, this one's got a more. Um, Marvella, M A R V E L L A, Marvella. Mm, these got marked too. Um, Monet. Okay. Oh. oh, I put them all in one bag. So. That's fine. Okay. 107. 107 is pendants and scarf loops. Dollar. Dollar. Is it a locker? Is it open? Oh, yeah, it does. How about that? There it goes. And open it. Place for a couple of pictures. Another thing, I love lockets. Sentimental pearls. Another one. Another one. Another one. Another one. I love scarves. I don't learn how to buy love them. If, I, if it's like if we're going to theater or something, you know how sometimes it can be 100 degrees outside, but they have the air crank. You get. I just want a little something over my shoulders. I like to wear like a um, scarf shawl thing, and I've tried these things. I don't know what it is. I'm just sad. I, I can't. It looks strange. And I, I just put it over my shoulders. That uh, it just, I'm sad. I really, I don't know how to dress myself. And he's no help at all. <laughs> he has no help. I have no how sense this, of fashion. Well, at how all. does this no. look? It's fine. And then I see a mirror or something, and I'm like, you let me, you let me go out. One oh three. Five necklaces. One is a neck wrap. One dollar. Yeah. 
Coca Cola. Coca Cola. Three dollars. You know how old this is? I mean, how do you have jewelry this old, brand new that you've done? Where's it been? You know, I, I don't. I just don't understand. My jewelry box is packed. I mean, well, no, I was going to say these are rich people. So they having to add a garage sale or something. But these are rich people. I don't think they have. Well, one thing, you couldn't have found your other house, house if your life depended on it. These are feathers on the end. That's the wrap. Yeah. Are they, they're not real feathers. They're no, they're gold. They're not real feathers, no. Well, I don't know if it's either gold or not. But well, they're gold they're tone. Gold tone. Hmm. Another big long chain. And then there's the chain. Um, I'm impressed with this one. And there's that. That's pretty. Is that white or gold? It's white on the front, gold. Oh, white enamel. White enamel. Yeah. That's I didn't look to see if there's a mark on it. I don't see one. That's pretty. Oh, that's interesting. That was a brooch, I blanked it. Oh, Anything else? Oh. You, you got control of the bag. Forget me. We got number 133. 133. Choker and bracelet vintage Poro set. $8. I looked this up and the necklace was sold, but they didn't have the bracelet uh, with it. So that's why I paid up on it because it was enough for the necklace selling. That I thought if I had the bracelet, I could make a profit in one of that much money. Mm. Money. Except for there's a kink right here. Can you get this kink out? Let me just took one out of this one. Let's see if, uh, you just got to realign it. I don't know where there could be a serious kink in it. Oh, there's a kink in this one too. Oh, no, that there. one. There, see? Comes right out. Okay. You've got to get it to line up. But... Yeah. That's a pretty set. That really is a pretty bicep. Bracelet, bracelet. Yeah. Um, Can I go over there? Yeah, I was going to say something I forgot what. I don't know. Okay, it's the last one of the jewelry. Uh, 136. Clip earrings, two pair, nice. One dollar. Mm, those are pretty. Those are very pretty. Mm. Gaudy earrings. They're not gaudy. Very pretty. These are marked, honey. Oh, I didn't look yet. They're not clipped. They're screw back. Screw back. Yeah, oh, anyway, they are clipped. Okay. You can wear oh, them I like see. that. And then you can or add this you can piece put to the it. hoop on it. But the mark. Exactly. Mark is on the. The thing. Yeah. These are really nice. I like these. It's not my style, but I really. Those would be really nice. Like I like the fact you can make two different power of e power, power pair of earrings out of them and uh, oh my gosh, these are so tiny. Why bother? I'm sorry for y'all people who win little earrings. I know y'all are dainty, feminine women, and they look good on you. They just get lost on me. Yeah, that's pretty. Look at me. Yeah. You can definitely mark on there. Well, you use your little camera. Yeah, I'm going to have to use that to read it. 
All right, let me pause this. So, all right. You know, like that's you, all the. That's jewelry. all the jewelry we got. Household stuff still yeah. in the garage. Like I said, we got. We have probably Two three boxes. more videos. Uh, and that we have to take in our garage if it ever stops raining. If it stops raining, which it's still. Uh, let's see what else. Oh, um, winter water aerobics again went twice this week. Yeah. I went Friday and my friend Sue taught the class and she killed me. Monday. Excuse me. Uh, there was a young girl that taught it, and she was like, "Raise your arm." There it is. It's just, I'm like, "Oh, this is easy. I can do this." All day Sue long. Sue killed me. She. She made you work for it. Oh, well, I'm so sore. It's like touch your touch, touch your nose with your knee. You know, it was like do your leg like a frog. I'm like, ski. I'm like, oh my. God and the jumping jacks in the water. And I'm thinking in my head, well maybe I shouldn't like go all out. Maybe I should just kinda of till I'm warm up to it or whatever. I went all out. I could barely move yesterday, today a lot better. But I was I was at the other end of the pool swimming laps. I tried to get him to come do it. <laughs> I'd rather swim laps. Uh but I could see you all over there, and he's just going away at it, you know. <laughs> and just going, it's like, yeah, okay, I'm just going to keep swimming. Yeah, it was something else. Oh, you know what? We forgot. We what? got friend mail. <gasps> Ooh, let me go get that. Yeah, we completely forgot. Oh, yeah. Ethan won't open it. He's, he's so impatient. He's like a child. Um, no, so. Uh, oh, and. The acupuncturist uh, said I can go down to one time a week there. So, good news. If you never, if you have severe they arthritis, migraines, um, you know, just severe pain of any kind. I know some people think it's like hocus pocus or whatever, we but if you box. have a um, friend mail, I don't really have Yay! Yes. Uh, give it a try. If you have a, some of times it's not a reasonable amount, you know, how working down your insurance is. Like, well, you know what? Some people said their insurance has started covering it. But um, if you've tried everything else, give it a try. Uh, I was kind of leery too, but I'm amazed. Uh, so, yeah, I, I want to feel good. I want to be able to. Okay. I want to be able to go and do. And, it's a box. They sent us a box. They needed a box. Let's show them. They sent a box. <laughs> we left again. Why did the camera, the camera so all of a sudden got dark? Oh, I was throwing something in front of the camera. Okay. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll guess I'll open up this thing. It's going to be more boxes. Let's see if there's another box inside the box. I kind of wanted a kitten. There's no holes in the box. Oh, that could be a problem. Did you see the kitten? Aren't they cute? They're so cute. They're at the some flea market this weekend, okay. and they're getting rained Here on. Here comes the next box. They're getting uh, rained on too. I hope they get some clear days. Uh, Matt's nice to do the flea market circuit. Oh God, forgive me. That was hell. Bubble wrap. That would be put to good use. Uh, I'll just exchange your bubble wrap. Pottery vases brown. Oh, I don't know. It's a nice. necklace. Any jewelry? Looks like um. It's not what I said. I suppose that's something stupid. It looks like freshwater pearls. Thank you. That's all I'm trying to think of. Kitty and Max are having a wrapping contest. Yeah. We can wrap the best. Wrap the best. There you go. Oh, oh. Yeah, it's got those screws. I love these because I cannot uh, get 
those little uh, lobster hooks or the other little circle hooks. Oh, ka-ching! Oh, a hook. I'm going to try it. I haven't done it in a while. But we actually been having halfway decent sales. But yesterday, I went and I promoted like 50 listings. And I had some really old merchandise. And I put it, I made sure I took all the free shipping out of it. And then I put it on for 50% off. Go away. So, I expected to hear cha-ching, cha-ching, cha-ching. We heard one. So, uh, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Oh, this is pretty. Huh? It is green and pink. Is the wine off the beeswax? The beeswax is to protect wood, not just off your safe. That's the great potato filler. You have to try this for dinner last night. They're so good. Actually, let me have any of these. We bid on one and won it at the uh, charity auction for a fundraiser auction for Tanya Sheets, the one who's uh, 50 Treasures. And Max has got the first two they sent us hidden away and won't let me near them. Here's one. This is the one of the first ones. I've been using it. And then we got its mate. mate. I'm not allowed to have sharp objects. These are these There's are your bottle. Now you have one. When I'm asleep tonight, he'll go and take it away and hide it somewhere. Of course. <laughs> these are beautiful. They sell these on their um, website, Idaho Hillbilly, on eBay, and they also have a uh, webpage, IdahoHillbilly.com, and you can get the railroad spike knives there. I think those will wait in this, but uh, they're well worth the wait. Uh, wait, yeah, that's what I said, wait. Yeah. Oh! Oh, Lord. Oh! I was trying to figure out what it was, and then all of a sudden, it just dawned, as soon as I... Broke away the cardboard around it. Oh. Hey, oh, Lord. Y'all need to pick that just for him. I'm never this good. Got the little hooks on the bottom. And it's got a place to hang it on the wall. Western Journey. America. Uh, uh. We got power problems. <laughs> storm. You're not, you're not even noticing. There'd be a storm. You're not even noticing the nose part. Well, I know. It's got the road track around the outside. In a map? In a map, I'll yeah. I'll them. Yeah, I know. Well, let me... It's got awful dark in here all of a sudden. I'm going to turn the light back on. Our Sorry. Flicker, flicker of power there, and I knocked everything out. Luckily, we have a generator. Yeah. But I haven't come to that yet. But, oh, that's gorgeous. That. That's gorgeous. That is gorgeous. We're going to sleep with this one. All right. I don't know. We took our Very grandson whenever I may have said, just forgive me, I'll repeat myself. Thank you. Um, Thank you very much. Yes, he loves that, I can tell you. You got your knife. Yeah. All right, all right. Sure. Um, we took him, they were going to the beach for vacation, and we took him, like, you know, the uh, tail and rake and all that kind of stuff. And he slept with him for three days. He wouldn't want to take him away from him. So <laughs> this will be Max doing the dust. He'll, um, so OCD. But no, that's that's fabulous. I've never yeah. seen anything like that. Boy, we could sell those like hotcakes here in railroad town. Yeah, this yeah. is definitely a railroad town. All right. Well, well I'm sorry. No, I just noticed <laughs> it says eight seconds, eight minutes. Eight minutes. Well, that yeah, that's this segment is eight oh. minutes long. We probably have. Easily. I'm thinking we've only been on talk in eight minutes. No, 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 no. We got uh, four different ones, eight to ten minutes long. So we're probably getting close to an hour now. Yeah. Well, all right, when's the last one we posted? Sorry, we haven't posted. It's been uh, what we're going to, but five days. Yeah, sorry. I mean, we really do have a lot, but we got stuff to do. And literally, the weather last night. I said literally a lot. I'm. On the news you last night, to oh God, um, next seven days, Rain. between 60 and 80% yes. chance. Well, I mean, we're 
we're fortunate in that there's no um we're not going to flood we're too high up and right there's high. not going to be a mudslide because we have vegetation and uh trees yeah. all behind us and stuff yeah. and and there have been there's flooding and there was one house that slid literally big old just went straight house. across that way <laughs> yeah it slid down the mountain and literally the it's, floor uh, and the roof were together the other but side of the valley here that we're on. They have found out now, originally they weren't sure, they thought it was strange because it's never happened here. And they have found out now that a contractor was doing some work and... They didn't properly... They, the contractor said, I followed what... I did what was required of me. So he did what was required by law, but he didn't do what was necessary to keep anything from happening. Yeah, so, so he had uh, a part in that... Yeah. happening uh they so, allow the ground to get over soaked and then give way yeah so now they're they're suing him luckily I mean, this this is horrible to say but they are they're wealthy and luckily they're suing him and they yeah. um uh, have can go rent an apartment or something until it's all taken care of you know they're not homeless or anything like that so but yeah everybody thought it was weird because i mean we had a they had, well, we weren't here but they had a flood in 85 it was the worst one in the history of the city and nothing like that happened and everybody's like why yeah. did they have a mudslide it's never happened before and then they started researching and found this out but yeah we're up high uh we do yeah. have the uh, wrong house. what's that it's the, the, here, this is meadow creek right we have here. a creek uh, that's down way down yeah, there down it, by the road track if it if it got up, that deep we're going to be looking for ARC. Yeah. The city <laughs> of Roanoke's in trouble if we yeah. get water. Yeah. Um, it'll be the island or the lake of Roanoke. But uh, anyway, it was a good talking to everybody again. We miss you when we don't talk to you. I know y'all can't talk back, but y'all will do. Oh, and thank you. Uh, we got some new subscribers. Um, and thank you very much. If you just wandered across us and you want to, <laughs> God bless you. Um, want to uh, keep up with us we do haul videos we do life videos we do ridiculous videos we do pretty much anything that whatever strikes our fancy, strikes our fancy at that time, the time. Yeah, we're we'll both old that. weird pogies yeah. um, who lead very boring lives um, yeah. but have really we kind of say what, say what we think we don't have a filter yeah yeah uh and uh we enjoy it life try to you know. yeah try our best to enjoy it yeah. as much as we can i'm trying to think what did we do yesterday oh we went to cracker barrel we cracker barrel we're old we, ate. we love cracker barrel yeah you know it's just full of all them old people and we just fit right in oh i got the catfish you got the catfish too yeah we both had the catfish this time yeah catfish yeah we look i like to look at the little shop and all my stuff that's way overpriced but yeah. i like to look and we got some peanut butter fudge yeah and it's good because yeah. while we were waiting for the three hours at tommy's we i can't have a lot but broke off a little piece and that sustained us so we didn't faint Paint. waiting for tommy right. to take, yeah. pull call our number and have us come up there but anyway uh is that it that's it. Well, are we gonna add, be adding more to this then? Yeah. This video. Well, no. Are we gonna publish? We this will. One? We'll put this Tommy's auction part one in front oh, okay. and then we'll have Tommy's auction part, part two, two, which is all the stuff down in the garage. Oh, this is Tommy's, yeah. Is this yeah. Tommy? This yeah. Tommy this Tommy. is Tommy's. The jewelry was Tommy's, yeah. See, we're so confused. We yeah. are. We really are. We gotta get all these videos up. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, and then Max also did a video of all the construction guys yeah. doing our decks yeah. and stuff. Yeah. And ladies, let me talk to you. Let me talk to you. <laughs> you know, I'm old. Uh, I'm 61, be 62 this year. And I really could care less about these young, good looking, hunky guys. I just, you know. But I do enjoy pretty things. So when I see in the movies and the TV shows and the commercials, when somebody's having construction, or even these home, you know, improvement shows and stuff, and the construction workers 
have like six packs and eight packs and gorgeous tans and well i can enjoy when, it when I they can... got here the first day and they were getting setting their stuff out one of them came and knocked on the door and she was she wasn't uh she was still asleep and uh i answered the door and they they says yeah we're here to get started and uh do you mind if we work without our shirts on and i didn't think anything of it at the time and I said, yeah, sure, it doesn't bother me one bit. And I uh, closed the door, and I went on about my business. And then later on... I, I finally wake up, and I'm like, <laughs> yay! Now run! Look out the window. Yeah, they, they have more than a six-pack. Plumbers, have... plumbers crack. And beer barrels. Man boobs. <laughs> Ugliest tattoos I've ever seen. I don't even know what the hell they were. Excuse me, I said hell, I'm sorry. Oh, that was that one kid, yeah. He had some... I don't know what they were. It looked like... The guy's ink ran like his tattoo and it's I, splattering. I, I don't know. Yeah. But where are the ones on the, you know, like I say, I, I don't really want one of them, but they would have been, I would have spent more time at the window. Yeah, I just took one look and went, nope, not interested. They were polite though. Like I say, yeah. asking like about that shirts and whenever they were going to do something, they'd knock on the door and, you know, excuse me, ma'am, you know. We need to run to Lowe's. We forgot this or that. Or, you know, they told us when they're going to lunch and stuff. Very polite. You know, good old Southern boys. But there wasn't a pretty one of them in the bunch. There was, what, like four or uh, six of them were four, rotating. Four of them. Well, there's the uh, the boss. He's the old, old gray-haired guy. And then his supervisor for this crew. And then he had three people working for the supervisor. Yeah. Not one of them. Supervisors were pretty rough looking. He, Not he, a one he of them. rode it hard and put away wet. I think mean, he, he was. He looked like he was. So. Kind of rough oh life. well. But I was gonna secretly videotape some for you ladies, but. No. I'll do you a favor and not yeah, do it. That probably better off if you didn't. No. But anyway, it's time. It's time. Mhm. All right. Don't get so busy. Oh, I was thinking of something. <laughs> my my mind. Well, I could see something wandering there. But... Yeah, my, my, my mind went on vacation without my body. Yeah. Uh, yeah, don't get so, so busy making, making a living, living that, that you forget, forget to, to make, make a life. life. Be kind to mm-hmm. others, love one another, and take a nap today. Yeah. It's raining. It's raining. There's nothing At least here else it to is. do. It, it, for your excuse, you say it's raining when they say it's sunny out. No, it's raining somewhere. Here. We'll see y'all next time. Bye. Bye. That God bless the broken road that led me straight to you.